Investigators say a suspect wanted for stalking and shooting homeless men is now in custody. At least five men were shot, two of them fatally. CBS News John Diaz joins us live from Soho with details. John. Chris and Mary, all five of those shootings, according to police, were all linked back to this same gun. And at this hour, police in D.C. saying that they have that uh, suspect in custody. They are still questioning him uh, at this hour with charges still pending. The reward posters hung up around Soho can now come down. Since police say they caught the man they've been tracking, wanted for targeting and shooting five homeless men in less than two weeks. They are humans just like us. Maybe they are in a difficult place right now. Who hasn't been? And I hope he gets what what he deserves. Detectives say the man seen in this photo is responsible for two shootings in New York City and three more in the nation's capital. All of the victims were sleeping on the streets. Two of them were killed. Surveillance video from this weekend shows the moments before the suspect fatally shot a man in Lower Manhattan point blank. I saw the video and it broke my heart. What was so sad about that is that guy was just minding his own business, just sleeping and just like, you know, not doing anything. He's already like in a bad position. On Twitter, Mayor Adams thanked officers, saying, quote, We promised that we'd bring this killer to justice. We kept that promise. He made that vow just yesterday during a joint press conference with the NYPD, Metropolitan PD, and ATF agents. And this morning, an ATF Washington Field Division found the suspect in southeast Washington, D.C., walking down the street. We are committed to reducing violent crime in our communities through strategies driven by intelligence, technology, and proven science. A D.C. police captain who was born and raised in New York is being credited for connecting the intercity shootings. He happened to be scrolling through his social media uh, over the weekend where he saw an image of the New York City suspect uh, that was put out to the public. Now, it is still unclear if that reward of up to $70,000 for information that led to arrest, if that actually helped lead police to tracking down this suspect. But earlier this morning, though, police on Twitter, uh, Washington, D.C. police, they did thank the community for all of their tips. We're live this afternoon from Soho. John Diaz, CBS 2 News. John, thank you.